Welcome to Automotive Territory! We have got great news for you. Tesla's family has just grown, and Elon Musk's youngest child is an extremely powerful semi-truck that supposedly can outtorque any diesel and even drag it uphill. To celebrate this amazing event together with the rest of the EV community, we have prepared a review of Tesla Semi, along with the world's 10 best electric cargo vehicles. Interestingly, no matter how groundbreaking and sexy the newest Tesla is, it will not be the first production e-cargo truck. As a matter of fact, there is quite a number of already operational heavy-duty vehicles with electric powertrains from such companies as BYD, Daimler and Nikola. If you care to learn more about them and find out about the competition your favorite car manufacturer will have to face in the future, stick with us a little longer. But before we begin, we wanted to ask you to share your opinion about Musk's latest creation in the comments below and subscribe to our channel. Enjoy the ride! Tesla Semi Truck It is finally here! The Tesla Semi was unveiled in November 2017, and it is everything that Elon Musk had promised – the Optimus Prime of trucks that traveled from the galaxy far, far away. But all jokes aside, the new Tesla is a Class 8 cargo truck that on paper easily outperforms any diesel by such a margin that they all seem like snails. It gets equipped by four independent electric motors that ensure a sports car driving experience on a heavy cargo truck. 0 to 60 acceleration without the trailer takes just 5 seconds, while the fully loaded 80,000 pounds vehicle gets to 60 in just 20 seconds. Moreover, it can travel at the max speed of 65 miles per hour up the 5% grade hill at max gross. The major concern that experts had about this Tesla newcomer was range, and everyone predicted 2 to 300 miles on each charge, but Semi can make 500 miles. It will also get equipped with advanced safety features like front collision prevention, pedestrian detection, lane keep assist and, most importantly, computer-controlled flip-over prevention. This truck is guaranteed by the manufacturer not to break down within 1 million miles and should be 20% cheaper to operate than a diesel. The production is starting in 2019, so within just two years, Tesla could start their journey to become the leader of cargo transportation. AEOS from Cummins Cummins is the best known as the manufacturer of great diesel engines, but in an attempt to stay relevant with the world trends, a separate electric division was started within the company. By introducing their all-electric AEOS hauler tractor in August 2017, they actually beat Tesla to the punch by two and a half months. AEOS is a sleek-looking cargo truck that belongs to the Class 7 Semi, weighs 18,000 pounds and was primarily designed as a local freighter. The installed battery is a humble 140 kWh, good for 100 miles of hauling a 44,000 pounds payload. AEOS will be delivered to the first commercial buyers in the start of 2019, and in 2020 it will be followed up by a plug-in hybrid notification for range extension that will incorporate into the powertrain an efficient diesel engine for charge generation, resulting in 50% increase of fuel efficiency. Nikola One The American startup Nikola Motor has presented a truck of the future Nikola One in 2017 that will hit the road by the year 2020. This powerful freighter will be equipped with an electric drive with a 6x6 formula. This will allow to provide thrust for each wheel and ensure the highest efficiency of movement in any conditions. The powertrain of this vehicle will be using lithium-ion batteries to store energy and onboard generator running on hydrogen fuel cells. The truck is expected to have immense power output of 1,000 horsepower and 2,000 pound-feet of torque. With a range of 1,250 miles and an extended hydrogen fuel station network, Nikola One will be able to cleanly deliver heavy payloads to every corner of the world. Efuso Vision One This truck is a creation of Mitsubishi Fuso Truck and Bus Corporation and Daimler, that owns 85% of the before-mentioned enterprise. The Efuso is designed with a vision for local and intercity transportation, given that the distance is within the 220 miles range that is guaranteed by a 300 kWh battery. The gross vehicle weight is about 23 tons, and the payload is approximately 11 tons, and that is just 3 tons short of the diesel counterparts. 
Even though it is still a prototype, the sales could start within 4 years and gradually all the trucks from this brand will have an electrically powered option. Mercedes-Benz electric truck Meet the urban e-truck, a high-tech means of transportation that is tasked to transform the world of commercial vehicles and set a trend for the years to come. This Mercedes will be equipped with a massive 212 kWh battery pack to juice up two electric motors with a combined output of 340 horsepower and 737 pound-feet of torque. Although the total driving range of this truck is about 125 miles, green driving is not the reason why e-truck will become a king on the road in less than 10 years. Mercedes is making a major push for self-steering future of cargo transportation. Engineers are currently trying to reduce driver's tasks to the minimum by introducing the highway pilot. This sophisticated software should be able to safely steer the vehicle on the road, react to dangerous situations and exchange information with neighboring vehicles. Fuso e -Canter. e canter is the third generation of the world's first all-electric light truck. The new e canter uses an electric motor with a 185 kilowatt or 248 horsepower yield and torque of 280 pound-feet. Power is transferred to the rear axle by single-speed transmission. Depending on the load and usage, the 70 kWh battery provides a range of more than 70 miles. The batteries are spread over five units, one centrally in the frame right behind the cab and two more on each side of the frame. It is estimated that e canter will save $1,500 per every 10,000 miles, which is quite a lot for commercial savings. The short range should not be put into the disadvantage bucket for e canter. It is a narrowly targeted truck for clean and silent intracity transportation that is growing in demand with each year. Trucks from BYD Chinese company BYD, aka Build Your Dreams, might not be universally well known by regular consumers around the globe, but it is actually one of the world's biggest electric transport manufacturers. It has successfully produced serious lightweight electric cars, but it is most known for city buses. In the recent years, BYD has been trying their skills in developing all-electric cargo trucks. Their current lineup is represented by four trucks, classes 5, 6 and 8, and probably the world's first all-electric terminal tractor. The most powerful semi-truck is the Class 8. It gets equipped with two e-motors that combine generate 482 horsepower and 2,212 pound-feet of torque, good for 100,000 pounds towing. And the juices coming from the proprietary iron phosphate 188 kWh battery that ensures 90 miles of range and suffers only 20% degradation in 20 years. Other trucks from BYD are much smaller and humbler, but are absolutely capable of completing dedicated tasks. Mercedes-Benz Vision Being only a designer's vision at this stage, this van primarily remains a mystery from the point of technical specifications. However, Mercedes has revealed plenty of information from the conceptual perspective. The Vision van will be equipped with a 75 kW electric drive system with a driving range of up to 167 miles on a charge, which makes it a perfect last-mile delivery means. Pure electric driving will additionally guarantee the possibility to use this van within the inner city zones, where autos with internal combustion engines are prohibited. The Vision van will become a part of a fully automated delivery management system, enhanced by two drones, with a payload of 5 pounds and autonomous delivery within a radius of 6 miles. Eveco Daily In order to compete on the tough market of short-range transportation, Eveco had to make their electric vans as versatile as possible and close every imaginable niche. Daily Electric could be factory assembled to possess a body of a refrigerator, passenger shuttle, motorhome, dumpster or cargo truck. Depending on the chosen setup, it will be geared with either an 80 or 107 horsepower motor and the standard battery should store enough charge for 175 miles. Cargo volume reaches 19.6 cubic meters and the cross weight cannot exceed 5.6 tons. If Evaco continues investing into development of their electric cargo vents, chances are that they will eventually push out IC models from this manufacturer's garage. LDV EV80 LDV is the UK-based company 
currently owned by the Chinese corporation SAIC, that revitalized this British car maker that has been silent for the past seven years. Yet, they are demonstrating a marvelous comeback in November 2017 with an all-electric cargo van LTV EV80. Up front, it carries a capable 123 horsepower electric motor that yields 236 pound-feet of torque. The lithium-ion phosphate battery is not on the impressive spectrum, storing just 56 kWh, but it offers acceptable 130 miles of green driving. With a payload of 1 ton, LTV EV80 could become a rather hot seller for the last mile delivery needs within the cities with strict emissions regulations. Arrival VW eCrafter and Nissan ENV200 Among the other potential cargo vehicles we could highlight are Volkswagen eCrafter that will be released in 2018, a range of trucks from the British company Arrival that is currently being tested by the Royal Mail and their lineup includes 3.5, 6 and 7.5 ton trucks and Nissan ENV200 cargo van that is based on the widely popular Nissan Leaf. So what do you say? Can any of these trucks create decent competition for Musk's power truck? Share your thoughts in the comment section and make sure to follow our channel. More great content about EVs is lying ahead. May the torque be with you!